a dense mangrove forest, second largest along the east coast of India, spreads across the vast delta of the Godavari. Nearly two-thirds of these forests fall within the Koringa Wildlife Sanctuary. Straddling land and sea, this is an ecosystem of interdependence and synergy. Twice a day, the tides rise and flood the forest floor. The shallow waters turn into breeding grounds for new life as juvenile fish find food and refuge. When the tide ebbs, the wet soil, rich in algae and fungi, invites a variety of creatures to the surface. Mudskippers hop out of their burrows and fiddler crabs scoop up mud for nutrients and discard sand balls, keeping the forest floor aerated. Above, the branching trees form an impenetrable mesh of hypnotic stillness. The silence is deceptive. The dense canopy holds many secrets. Predators bask in its branches, waiting for prey. The night beckons its apex predator, the elusive fishing cat. Cloaked in darkness, this mysterious hunter stalks the river's edge. The sanctuary also supports local fisher folk, who have developed a complex communal fishing system to keep overfishing in check, ensuring the marine health of the creeks. The Forest Department conducts conservation and restoration drives to help maintain the precious balance of Coringa's sensitive ecosystem. Like the network of roots that make the mangrove forest strong, every organism here contributes to the health of the sanctuary.